Hi friends, this is Mark with StorageCraft Support. Today we're going to cover the scheduling tab in StorageCraft's SPX software. Now there are many options you can choose when scheduling your backup job. The options you choose should be based on the requirements for your client. Now the first type of backup job we're going to talk about is the continuous incremental backup job. This schedule allows you to create a single base image and then incremental images that capture any changes made on the system after the base image. The base image can be close to the size of the utilized space of the source volume, but incremental files will typically be very small. This job can be set to run as frequently as every 15 minutes or as infrequently as once every 24 hours. You can also adjust which days you would like the backup to run. Now this schedule requires you to use Image Manager in conjunction with SPX. Image Manager will consolidate the incremental files into daily, weekly, monthly, and rolling consolidated files. This will create a shorter chain which will reduce the amount of time needed to recover files or volumes. It will also remove files no longer needed to save space on the destination and run periodic re-verifications on the images to ensure the file integrity. Image Manager has other great features as well, but we'll cover those in a later video. Now the next type of schedule we're going to cover is the mixed schedule. This schedule allows you to create a base image and incrementals on a weekly or monthly basis. Each time a new base image is created, there is a new incremental set that will be tied to this specific base image. Image Manager is not necessary for this type of schedule, but if you are using a monthly schedule, it is highly recommended in order to consolidate the files into the shortest possible path to restore. This type of schedule will use more storage on the backup destination, as there will be more base images which require more storage. To manage the storage, you'll want to use the retention settings under the Advanced tab, which we'll cover in a later video. Now the next schedule we're going to cover is the full schedule. This schedule creates full backups when uh, the backup is scheduled to run. These backups can run once a day. No incrementals will be created, and incremental files cannot be added to a full backup schedule later on. Now the last type of schedule we're going to cover is the full manual. This schedule will create a single full image at the scheduled time or immediately. No other backups will run on this schedule, full or incrementals. This concludes the different scheduling options in StorageCraft's SPX. If you found this information useful, please click like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. For additional in-depth training and certifications, please log in to academy.storagecraft.com. And don't forget to have a great day.